Hello, everybody. Welcome back to WWTF. We're the game show on Mike Mike C. And apparently, I'm a NASA. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> Me too. Welcome. How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> so great. So basically, um, we love that you guys comment on our videos and, you know, even like, dislike, you know what I'm saying, get your word out there. But there's one thing I want to get across the, get across the board straight. We do not censor or delete any type of uh, comments Correct. in our videos. We do not do that. Any type of feedback you guys give, whatever, we take that and, you know, and we respond to it or not. You know, as far as it's a platform for you guys to get your voices voices and opinions across. Mm -hmm. You know, we're not going to take that away from nobody. Mm -hmm. But uh, we don't edit our stuff. No. <laughs> we do not delete anything. No. So we appreciate your comments. Google Stadia, you know, as far as what you feel that, like like it's going to work or that it's not. We gave our opinion why it's not. You guys say, hey, it's great. You had a great time playing. That's good for you guys, though. Mm -hmm. But we're giving it all as far as what we have. Yeah. Now, I, I forget the guy's name. Mm -hmm. But I'm I'm not throwing no shade at him. I appreciate his comments. Mm -hmm. But his comments were a little harsh. A little aggressive, and, yeah. Yeah, and I didn't delete it. Uh -huh. And he had made a comment about uh, something about us deleting comments where we never delete any comments. Well, Mike is looking it up now. We don't delete anybody comments. We let them stay on there because you have the freedom of speech. And this is what that show, this is what this show does. The big thing was over people were not so uh, flattered about the statements that we made about Google Stadia, how it will not work. And I still stand behind that statement that it will not work. And the reason why it would I'm not... Go down eventually. And the reason that it would not... That's the episode. We'll put a link into it. The reason why um, it will not work is a number of things. And we'll say this again. First of all, you're relying on the streaming services and the data caps that your internet provider will uh, allow you to. So if they're allowing you 25 gigs per month, these games exceed that for streaming. And what, what's the guy's name? Well, I'm not going to talk about him, but another guy just chimed in how he said we agree with... Uh as far as the internet, as far as the caps and everything, there are going to be caps on this internet service. As yeah. far as your your, uh, your bandwidth and everything like that, get it up. All these games are not going to run fluently on all these type of no, uh, not. services because that's that's just not feasible with far as the technology and stuff that they have today. It's it's no way that it's going to be a smooth transition with far as these games running uh, streamlessly. No, they they're not. And the other point I don't know if I made it with this one is you don't own any type of physical media. Which means if your internet goes down and Verizon and Comcast or Cox Cable, whoever your internet provider is, is famous for going down for a period of time. Guess what? You don't have access to that media that you brought. And I think it's unfair for them to be charging full price for a, uh, a copy of a game that you do not own physically. If your internet goes down... Guess what? Are you going to be able to play the game? No, because you got to rely on that uh, streaming service. If somebody hacks into those servers, are you going to be able to play the game? No. Why? Because they're going to shut that server down. When Google Stadia is, is no longer in uh, existence, then all that money that you pay for these games, are you going to be able to download them? I highly, I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. And then once you finish with the game, and we talk a, a bad about GameStop a lot. Well, at least when you buy games, you can trade them in. Either trade them into uh, a GameStop or you can even mm -hmm. trade them into Best Buy right. and get some money back. What's the use of having 100 games and you finish half of those and you don't want to play them no more? You can turn that in and get the, uh, the latest Xbox or the latest PlayStation or the latest Nintendo, whatever that comes out. Or... Something else, you know what I'm saying? And that's why it's not going to work. And what I was saying that their track record with Google, they tend to start projects and then they just Abandoned, evaporate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you never hear of them again. Right. So many apps that they started, the Google Glasses or whatever they, they call it started, I thought that that was going to go far. Yeah. But it just it's disappeared. Faded away. Yeah. Faded away. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it's... And we... we Say this again. It is not 
going to work. It is not going to work. There's no way possible that this is going to work. Because, like, the biggest thing is you don't own a physical copy of this game. You don't. No. And then you're relying on the server to stream it to you. There are people that's like in West Virginia uh, uh, that don't have internet service or rely on DSL. You try streaming uh, 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 Assassin's Creed through DSL. Let's see how much you'll lag. You know what I'm saying? You try to play multiplayer with somebody else using that slow internet connection, they're going to kick you off. They're definitely going to boot you off. We don't want to play with We don't want to play with him because you're lagging. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it, it's it's not going to, for some people, it's not going to, not even some people, it's just not going to work because your data, you only allow a certain data cap with your internet provider. Especially if you're dealing, playing this stuff on a cell phone, you're, you have a data cap with that as well. So how are they going to get past that? You're going to pay $59 for the game. Plus, you're going to pay an additional uh, fee for going over your limit for your uh, your data plan. So, how is that going to work? Uh, a $59 game is now is going to be costing you maybe $100. Now, maybe I'm exaggerating a little bit, but that extra fee that they charge you, so many gigs per month, you're going to exceed that. You're really going to exceed that. These aren't like Atari games. And they're talking about Mortal Kombat, Ghost Recon, all these games that's coming out now. You know, you're going to be on a data cap with this stuff. Especially you're streaming it from another service. And then again, I I, I hate to keep hitting the uh, uh, the nail on the, on the horse's head with this, but you don't own a physical copy of what you're purchasing, and that is troubling within itself. So again, I don't. I know it's not going to work. Uh, you know, that's just one of the points that we uh, had to hit on, but we do not delete anything that far as is up, uh, as far as any comments mm -hmm. up on our uh, channel. So keep the comments coming. We appreciate you guys tuning in and actually responding. So, hey, keep it coming, man. And I even offered this guy an opportunity to come on to the show mm -hmm. and tell me why you think that it'll work or tell me your experience if you had Google Stadium. And it will be unedited. Unedited. It, I'll start it from the time we count off to record to the time we end it off. And you'll see it's seamless. No edits. Just as long as you be respectful to us, mm -hmm. you know, and we will be respectful to you. Correct. So if you're watching this video, again, we'll link the video that we're responding to in the description of this. If you feel that we've said something that y'all do not like, or y'all don't agree with, and you want to come on to the show and voice your opinion, you can do so by Skype, and we will put you on the show. We won't show you in a negative light at all. And we, again, we don't delete any comments. We don't. We Remember that guy, I forget what season it was, mm. but he, he said something, and it was real negative, and I said... Oh, well, um, thank you for your comment. Thank you for showing us some love. I want to show some love back. Here's a code. To, I think I either gave him Watch Dogs or something else. And then he responded back. Damn, man, I apologize for making that comment. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? But you got to understand, we don't delete anything. You have the freedom <coughs> of speech on this channel. We don't trump you. <laughs> you have the freedom of speech. On this channel, you don't get censored. Even if you say, Fred, you're too black or you're too fat or whatever, I don't delete that. You know what I'm saying? I just give me motivation to get a little bit skinnier. And I I can't do nothing about the blackness. Hey, look, I was born with this. You know what I'm saying? But look, it's we don't delete no comments. And we appreciate everybody that comments on these videos, especially if you watch it to the end. That's your... Eat. Even if you say anything bad about us, at least you watch it to the end and I'll help out, help out numbers. You know what I'm saying? Because that video grew. Because our videos don't normally get the traction that we would like. And it takes us a, a little while to get over two triple digits. But the second day I checked it, it was like at 40-something. I was like, wow. 
And then the third day I checked it, it was like at 186. And it's probably a little bit more there now. Yeah. But I was like, and then I'm reading the comments, and I'm like, oh, well, are these people from Google? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> it might be, so. Uh, look, let us, we, we have not tried it. I, I don't. I don't desire to try it because of the data cap. Google, if that's you putting that stuff in the comments, you got two people that host this show. Give us access to Google Google Stadia so we can review it and we'll we'll give our honest opinion. Yep. And if we are wrong, then we are wrong. Have somebody to come in and tell us detailed yep. how this is going to work if you have a data cap with your internet provider. Yep. How will it work? Correct. That's that's all we say. Correct. All right. Very informative. Mm -hmm. All right. So, uh, like always, you guys can hit us up at the Game Show Gmail.com. That's the Game Show today. Don't forget to have a Facebook store page for our low, low prices. Don't forget to hit us with V-Town. Don't forget to subscribe. Come get us a club member. And don't forget to hit that bell to be notified when we drop videos like these. And please remember to like, subscribe, and follow all our social media networks. Join our stream as me and our website for me where you can get some free stuff. Sure. And we'll see you next time on WWTF. Yeah, What's the fact? The Game Show. See you next time you watch. Sure.